Top story tonight, a federal judge declares Florida's ban on same-sex marriage unconstitutional. The fifth judge in the past six weeks to do so. And the ruling covers all 67 Florida counties. And while same-sex couples still can't get married in Florida because of pending appeals, as it is, Melissa Warren tells us now from our newsroom tonight, there is strong reaction from both sides of the issue. Melissa? U.S. District Judge Robert L. Hinkle ruled the ban voters added to the Florida Constitution in 2008 violates the equal protection and due process guaranteed in the 14th Amendment. The Suncoast reactions to the ruling were mixed. I, I think for our next generations, you know, my generation and the next generations, you know, they, they need to see that there's a, a world around them, a government around them that says you're the same as, as anyone else. Donna Hanley tries to tell the youth that come in for support at also that every day, but she says until they're allowed the same rights, that won't be the case. And if my partner or I get very ill and we're in the hospital and decisions need to be made, the hospital systems can, can bar one of us from making those decisions. The Florida Conference of Catholic Bishops issued this statement in reaction to Hinkle's ruling. The judge's ruling negates marriage as identified in our state constitution and approved by nearly 62% of the electorate in a 2008 ballot initiative. Despite this decision, we will continue to promote the truth of marriage, its foundational significance to society, and its importance to children. We are hopeful that ultimately the courts will recognize the true nature and meaning of marriage. But Hanley still believes with more judges ruling same-sex marriage bans unconstitutional, it's only a matter of time before she and other members of the Suncoast LGBT community get the rights marriage guarantees. You know, I think about it being kind of a domino effect. Uh, you know, the, the more and more judges and districts and areas that decide that, um, you know, LGBTQI people are entitled to the same support supports and um, same protections under the law, um, I think as it moves up to a higher chain of command, possibly up to the, the U.S. Supreme Court, that there's no doubt in my mind that they will have to start banning all of these bans. Hanley says she's not surprised Judge Hinkle made the ruling, but feared she wouldn't see a change in same-sex rights in her lifetime. What happens now that that ruling has been made? Well, Judge Hinkle issued a stay delaying the effect of his order, so no marriage licenses can be issued for gay couples yet. And Florida isn't alone. Virginia, Utah, Michigan, Ohio, Kentucky, and Tennessee, just to name a few, are dealing with similar cases. Well, there are appeals that are going forward, and a lot of people believe this is going to end up at the Supreme Court at some point for a uh, perhaps a final decision. Yes. Melissa, thank you.